Hello everyone, uh, this is Mina. Uh, today I'm going to show you on how you can download and install uh, Open EMR. And this presentation was prepared as part of the um, HAP 752 course in Advanced Health Informatics System. Uh, so before we get started uh, with the uh, with the with the slides on uh, how we can download an Open EMR, just to quickly tell you about what an open EMR is. Open EMR is a medical practice management software uh, which is used widely to store uh, electronic uh, medical records. So how do we download this, um, this open EMR into our computer? The first step is to go to the website www.open.emr.org and on top of uh, the navigation space you'll see download and you click on that one as you click on the download page it takes you to uh, to uh, a second section a second new page and down below that page you'll see a line which says appliance and under that you'll find a zip folder which says open EMR 4-1-1 appliance zip folder once you get into that you um, you click and you, uh, you unzip that file so while you do that it takes you to to it will direct you into a new page and that zip folder will start to download this might take about a few minutes after that uh, the the zip folder will get downloaded under your uh, download folder so in order for you for an ease of use uh, it's better if you copy this folder into your desktop so the saved file uh, on the desktop will look like this so once um, you saved it on your desktop what you have to do is click and unpack the zip folders which can be uh, seen on step two this might take about um, 20 to 25 minutes once the files are unpacked you will see uh, like the extraction files as it's uh, seen in uh, screenshot 3 so it lists all the files down like as you can see it here the, fo the file has been extracted and the zip folder has been unzipped what you have to do is go to a virtual uh, uh, box manager if you don't have it in your laptop you can download it for free so once you open the virtual box manager uh, go to the file on top and once you go there find the uh, virtual uh, media manager click on that one which will open up a box in this case try to find the folder the folder that I have saved which is the open EMR so once you uh, get to do into this page uh, you select a virtual hard disk file that you have saved in your uh, in your uh, folders so in this case which is the open EMR uh, file and then once you choose that one you hit next uh, and then it will take you uh, to the to the next page and it will start uh, uh, copying the the file that you uh, have uh, selected so in this case what you have to be careful uh, about is that the the file that you need to pick is the first one from the list of uh, extracted files uh so make sure that that's the uh this that's your uh, priority pick and that should be the file that should get copied and once you uh, click on that one hit next uh it will take you to a second page uh, which is the hard disk file type and for the hard disk file type choose vdi which is the virtual box box disk image and then hit next and after you hit next it will take you to another uh, box which is which is copying the virtual hard disk so uh, you'll find a radio button which is uh, already pre-selected which is the dynamic allocated uh, so don't change that that's uh, for uh, for storage on a physical hard disk so keep it as is and hit next so once you um, once you find this file hit copy and to the next page 
this uh, hard disk creation it might take about another 18 to 25 minutes so until it's uh, start like uh, downloading so give it a, a, about a good time once the download is complete um, close the box so this basically the slide is to show you the creation of the hard disk uh, hit next after finishing after finishing doing this so after your hard drive has been created what you have to do is we have to create the machine and in order to create to the machine we go to uh, the next part which is which says the machine and uh, uh, after that um, we a second box will open up which says name and operating system and then for the name we give it open EMR 4.1.1 version uh, and for the type uh, uh, <coughs> for the type we choose for the operating system type we choose Linux and then you hit next to the, uh, to, to the next one which will show you the memory size the memory f the recommended memory size for my computer is 768 megabyte it might differ uh, to uh, different computers so don't change anything just keep the recommended memory size and hit next uh, this page will allow you to uh, to uh, pick the uh, the saved uh, hard disk file that you have uh, already saved in your uh, desktop so in this case in order to create a new hard disk you have to select the open EMR uh, but first choose the radio button which says which is shown at the bottom which says use an existing virtual hard disk file and then uh, find the uh, open EMR file that you have saved in your uh, laptop and uh, click uh, create in this case uh, as you can see it in the uh, the uh, arrow at the bottom the open EMR 4.1.1 version uh, is displayed in the uh, virtual manager so before uh, we plan to start uh, our open EMR it's always good to check the settings so you go uh, back to the virtual uh, box manager and the, um, at the second button which says setting you click on that one and uh, you check for uh, the network uh, so make sure that the network shows host host only adapter so at this stage now we are ready to uh, start our machine so in order to start our machine we click on the uh, green arrow which is at the top bar uh, to start the machine so once we click on that the start uh, the start arrow uh, a, a black uh, uh, screen will will be displayed as you can see it on the screenshot and uh, it will start like uh, running a system check for quite a for quite few minutes and once that's complete uh, a second page will display uh, welcoming you to an open EMR So after we see the welcome page, it doesn't mean that our task to the download is complete. So in this case, what we have to do is we go to uh, we, as you can see it on the uh, uh, on the arrow, we uh, copy paste the link, which which is the one uh, the open EMR link, which 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 is the HTTPS one nine two point one six eight point five six, and we open. Uh, a new uh, browser and uh, copy paste uh, the entire link as it is and we hit advance so the HTTPS link that we just have inserted into the new open uh, into the new uh, browser will uh, bring us the login page for the open EMR t to display in this case in order to log in to the open EMR for use uh, we uh, use the uh, user uh, name and uh, password that's been given with the link so once we enter those uh, an open EMR page uh, will display for us and it will be ready for use I hope you have found uh, this uh, mini clip to be useful and thank you so much for watching